Now, CBS4 weather. Good morning, South Florida. So the rain is ending for a lot of us in South Florida from Broward through parts of Miami-Dade, but it doesn't mean that we won't see more rain later this afternoon. So don't leave the rain gear behind. Now, right now, the concern is really offshore. So for boaters out there, what we are expecting is basically uh, these showers to be pushing, uh, continue to push uh, farther away from the coast, so push on towards the east, but it will continue to bring in some of this uh, heavy rain into parts of the coastal areas of Miami-Dade County and we do expect uh, for the keys to stay mainly dry all right so I've been having some issues with my graphics but I think it's gonna work now here we go so lots of lightning strikes offshore how far is this uh, area of thunderstorms uh, from Key Biscayne it is about six to ten miles out so it's starting to move farther and farther away from the coast down into the 18 mile stretch you're dealing with some heavy rainfall yet again and then in the keys a lot quieter for at least uh, so far this morning look how cloudy it is over miami and the bay temperatures are quite on the mild side close to 80 degrees down in key west and marathon the breeze picks up a little bit of speed here and there especially when there's a shower thunderstorm rolling by for the most part today the winds will be out of the west 15 to 20 miles per hour by this afternoon now the reason for the thunderstorms is because of a stationary front which is kind of just to the north of us overlaying Lake Okeechobee but this stationary front will eventually start to press southward change into a cold front and it's going to help to push this moisture that we're dealing with right now just to the south of us so this is the moisture forecast this is by thursday later in the day i do expect some of this dry air to sneak in i think rain chances will be much lower tomorrow afternoon so a little more sunshine for our thursday even friday but then another area of moisture develops over the gulf of mexico with another front stalling into parts of central florida as we head into the weekend, which means the return for some afternoon thunderstorms Saturday and Sunday. So highs today, 86 degrees. Right now, it's a break from the rain for the most part, it's mainly offshore, but we will have daytime heating. The atmosphere is un unstable, so spotty downpours expected to develop this afternoon. Now, there are no advisories for boaters, so seas today two to four feet. The bay is at a moderate chop. It's still quite choppy, especially after that thunder thunderstorm rolled over Biscayne Bay at the moment. So just keep that in mind, boaters. You may want to head out a little later this morning. And for tomorrow, it's Earth Day, a bit drier by the afternoon hours.